guys, it's Rebecca. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Today's video is going to be an introduction for another project pen. This is going to be my intro for Drop 10 Before Summer. This is one of the, really the OG project pen collabs with the Fantastic Ladies. This, I think, if I remember correctly, I think this was one of the first projects that we did uh, and, and it was created by, by Amanda and Jessica. And um, like I said, this was part of the very few collabs that we did. And it's it's supposed to be kind of a summary themed project uh, where you wanna drop 10 products, meaning you wanna use them up and you wanna and or you can uh, add the weigh in portion, which is to lose 10 pounds, kind of getting ready for the summer. Now, um, for this project, I'm going to attempt to do both. Um, and hopefully I can be successful in dropping 10 pounds plus these 10 items and a lot of these items already have quite a bit of progress um, But I think that's I just want to give myself like some easy products and then a little some products that are gonna be a little bit harder to use uh, just because that, That's how it is. Um, I'm uploading this video a little bit later. They're supposed to start on May March 20th sorry, but um, I just wanted to keep like on track with my uploading schedule. So I had already uploaded something on the 19th. So I just wanted to keep my my days set, if that makes any sense. Uh, so it's going up a little bit later, but I started officially on the 20th. So that being said, I have 10 items here that I'm going to show you guys. And hopefully I can get these finished by the end. So I have um, a couple like face, eyes, lips, kind of all over the place. So I'm going to start with this contour kit this is the uh contour kit from measurable differences this is in my products i want to use up in 2021 and for this i'm going to only use one product and and i am going with this face powder right here i'm already working on the bronzer but realistically i cannot finish this bronzer in three months so i'm gonna try to attempt to finish this one the pants on these are pr pretty big 14 grams each but uh, i've already been using this to set my face so it does have a little bit of a dip right here but not quite like super oh you can see it kind of like right here you can see the little dip um, I do use a big fluffy brush and I apply it all over my face so hopefully I can finish that one and I'll be successful with that and I have another face powder here and this is from Wet n Wild this is the Reserve Your Cabana uh, bronzer uh, but this is what it looks like this is a, a dupe supposed to be for one of the hourglass ambient lighting pal palettes no powders um as you guys can see i have hit a lot a lot of pan and i feel like i do have still quite a bit of product up here it's still pretty high uh, if i look at the pan like at the side pan uh, but i think i can have this finished in three months um, i like mixing this powder with the powder that i have here um, all over the face and then I use this powder on its own to kind of clean up um, under my eyes and then kind of like mark my my bronzer but yes I love this powder this is the second one that I have purchased um, but it's getting up in age this was supposed to expire back in 2019 <laughs> so well the SPF because this has SPF and it expired in uh, 2019 so hopefully I just can get more use out of this guy and then just use it up uh, something I would repurchase definitely I mean I already have but it's a, it's a really nice one and then for like palettes type products I am picking up a shade from this Naked Basics eyeshadow palette and spoiler I already used up this shade right here uh, and I am working on this shade right here in the color Venus it's a kind of a slightly shimmery shade I hope you guys can see I hit pan already um, and I'm hoping that I can finish this one in the next three months. I have noticed that the shades from Urban Decay are pretty packed, like tightly packed. So hopefully in the next three months I can use this guy up and then it'll be another shade out of this little palette. That one is also in my products I want to use up in 2021. Then let's go with, I guess, face. Um, I have a primer from First Aid Beauty. This is the Coconut Skin Smoothing smoothie priming moisturizer i used a full size of this last year i believe it was maybe it was, with, maybe it was at the beginning of this year i don't know but it's not my favorite so i do want to finish it uh this is just the mini one and it's brand new if i'm not mistaken 
um, yeah, it's brand new. Whoop, I squeezed it out. Can you guys see? But um, yeah, I'm not a big fan of this guy. Um, so yeah, I just want to use it up and get it out of my collection. And the other like face type thing, well, kind of sort of face, is this Urban Decay Brow Endowed little deluxe size sample. One side is the primer, one side is the color. I did use it for the first time today. Um, that's what I'm wearing on my brows. It was interesting because I feel like the primer didn't deposit a lot of product. As you guys can see, that's right there. Or can you even see there? <laughs> it's kind of like a skin tone type product, which I think is kind of weird. But anyway, and then the other one is the brow wand. But I feel like it left like, like streaks. I had to kind of like really brush it in. Um, so I don't know. We'll see how long this takes me. I don't think this is going to take me too long because it's just a deluxe eye sample. I don't know how much product is in here. Um, oh yeah, 1.1 ml in each one. So shouldn't last me too long. Uh, hopefully I can finish that one pretty fast. Then I do have two eye products. The first one is a liquid liner from Kat Von D. This is the tattoo liner in the color Trooper. It's just a black felt tip liner. Um, I am wearing this one today. I have been w using this one for a little while now, so I, I don't foresee it lasting me the whole three months, um, but we'll see where we go with that. Um, actually, maybe this will last me just like this one or like a freebie one. Um, I think this one's just gonna last me the next month and then that'll be it uh, because it already, it doesn't look as matte when I do my second eye. I really have to work for it. So we'll see how that one goes. And the other eye product is this eye primer from e.l.f. This is in the color Sheer. It's just the regular um, eyeshadow primer. It has a doe foot applicator. And if I remember correctly from way back in the day, this is supposed to be a dupe for the NARS eyeshadow primer, the, the one that comes in kind of like a tube like this, but it's white. Um, I just started using this one uh, couple of weeks ago or maybe it has it been a month already i don't remember but i know that elf products don't come with a lot of product i don't know how much is in here i should have checked the website i like i said i've been using this for a, a while now so i don't have the packaging and it doesn't say here on the sticker uh, but i feel like it doesn't have a lot of product i think i can go through this one actually within the three months um elf products typically even though they're very inexpensive they have considerably less amount than like other products um so we'll see how that goes and then last but not least i have three lip products me and my lip products the first one is a lip liner this is the only lip liner i have in my collection this is from essence the stay stay eight hour lip uh liner in the color tea time number two i'm not wearing this today but i don't have a lot of product left <laughs> that's all i have left like nothing else rolls up uh, so this is another freebie. Um, I just, I don't know why I haven't used it. I don't know why I'm saving it. Um, I just need to get it used up and out of my collection and, and just done it over with. I don't need to keep products that have like the tiniest bit left. It's just sitting around. And then the other two are deluxe size sample of lip products. The first one is for one from Buxom. This is the Fulon Lip Cream in the color Rose Julep. This is tiny, this only has, uh, how much product does this have? I, I don't think it even says, it doesn't, but um, this is brand new. Oh, I love how Buxom lip glosses smell. <laughs> but yeah, this has very, very little product. It still has a stopper. Eventually I'll take out the stopper and I'll scoop out as much as I can with the wand. Uh, but I don't foresee this lasting me too, too long. And the next one is from NARS. This is the Vel Velvet Lip Glide. Uh, in the color Bound. This has two mLs. It looks like it might be a lot of product, but it's one of those that has a lot of packaging um, on the bottom. If I can just remove the sticker, there you go. So it doesn't have a lot of product, uh, I mean a lot of packaging, but it does have quite a bit. So I've seen worse products where there's more packaging, but uh, I've never used this formula. I know, um, is it Heather from I uh, love Heather Red that loves this formula. I can't remember, but um, yeah, this is brand new. I haven't used it, but again, it doesn't have a lot of product. I do have like four other lip products <laughs> that I'm working on in other project pens. So I don't foresee myself going through these as fast as I could if I wasn't using other lip products in other project pens, if you guys know what I mean. But 
that's it for now that's everything i have for my drop 10 before summer uh next update will be in a month and we'll see how many products i can have used up by then but for now that's all i have thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye